And what a march we had. Take a look at these numbers. As you can see, much more red uh, than any of the blue, meaning highs were very, very warm, running very warm for this time of year. We finished off 5.7 degrees from the average, so just overall a very warm March, even though we finished off a little bit below average for this time of year. Uh, so there's your satellite radar composite. Notice not a whole lot going on. If I step aside here, you can see the last of that big windmaker heading out, but here uh, in Las Vegas and even out to the west, just not a whole lot going on except dry conditions. Tomorrow we're going to see even warmer temperatures, and yes, that does mean it looks like we're going to break into the 80s, but changes coming on Monday. There's Monday at 7 o'clock. Notice this layer of clouds that pushes in. And then as we head into the afternoon, chances for rain in the forecast. I think it's going to be better, of course, for higher elevations, but some of that can come down into the Las Vegas Valley. But nonetheless, more than a rainmaker, it's going to be a windmaker, and this is what we're expecting. Luckily, it's nothing like we saw on Thursday, but still gusts to about 45 miles per hour on Monday. So I am expecting a wind advisory possibly to be issued uh, by tomorrow. Then on Tuesday, 30 mile per hour gusts, which means we'll be borderline breezy, windy more than anything, just nuisance winds. Then by the time we get to Wednesday, that moves out and high pressure is going to be building in. So for now, let's just enjoy the very nice weather that we have uh, coming tomorrow. Take a look, lunchtime 74 degrees by five o'clock, we'll be at 79. And when all is said and done, I'm expecting a high temperature of 83 degrees for the Las Vegas Valley, 83 in Henderson, uh, 84 in Boulder City, Laughlin, not quite at the 90 degree mark, but flirting with that 90 degree mark and 81 degrees for you folks in Pahrump. So here's your 13 first alert seven day planner. Big changes coming on Monday. Not only do we have that chance for rain, we have windy conditions and a cool down 72 degrees. So quite a difference more than a 10 degree cool down between Sunday and Monday. And then there's Tuesday 74 on that day, still breezy, then very clearly high pressure coming into the forecast and you can see 78 degrees for the high on Wednesday, Thursday and Friday that ridge of high pressure certainly strengthening and the good news is that we will have light winds as well. So toward the end of the week, a great time to plan any outdoor activities. However, once we head into Friday, still quite warm, but we have yet another system that's going to come in. This looks like another uh, fairly big wind maker, uh, 84 degrees on that day and then 81 on Saturday. Still windy.